This one is the project of solar based street lamp with IoT fault monitoring. Here these two are the street lamps. This one is the solar panel, the shielded acid battery, the uh, charge controller circuit and power circuit. This one is the node MCU ESP8266 board. These are the relay modules to switch the lamps. Now here power from the solar panel will be given to the charge controller here. This charge controller will convert the variable supply from solar panel into 12 volt DC and that converter part will do that work. Now that 12 volt DC will be filled to this shielded acid battery of 12 volt. This battery whenever this battery is discharged this 12 volt will be given to battery and uh, battery will be charged. Now same voltage from the battery is given to this power circuit of 5 volt and uh, this circuit will generate 5 volt which is given to the ESP8266 board and uh, the 12 volt from the battery is directly given to this relay modules and the street lamps. Now this ESP8266 board will monitor the sunlight using this upper IR sensor now if there is no sun both the street lights will be on now and if there is night means when there is dark this radar will send signal to the ESP8266 board and uh, the board will turn on the street lights automatically these street lights are fed on the power from the solar panel and battery now here this another LDR is placed and uh, used to detect the light from the street light. So when there is any fault in street light, the light from the street light will reduce or will be absent and that is detected by this LDR. This LDR will send signal to this uh, SP8266 board and our board will detect that street light is not generating proper light and uh, at that time it will take the fault and uh, will turn off that street light using this relay module and uh, then it will send signal to the web page now here this is the thingspeak web page interface on which there are four data fields we can see the first one is sl1 means street light one status when the street lights are on this green indicator will be turned on. This one is the fault at street light 1. When there is a fault detected at street light 1, this red indicator will be on. This one is the street light 2 status. This will be on when the street light 2 is on. And uh, this is the street light 2 fault status. This will be on when there is a fault detected at street light 2. Likewise, since the uh, both the street lights are off now, the status are off.